We beat Beijing. So we eat Beijing duck. Oh, I got that you got it. Got yeah, yeah, yeah. We eat Beijing duck. Yeah. We ate Beijing. I eat Beijing duck in Alive. Beijing. And I eat Beijing duck in Qingdao. Killed them alive. Killed them alive. Maybe, maybe next year, maybe they can beat us next year, but I don't think so. I don't think so. I love China. It's 18, 18, two Chinese team, two Japanese team, two Korean team, two Philippines team. So we get to go to their place? Yeah, six months. Will we go? Going down? I don't know yet. I, I don't know yet. I don't know. Maybe. Perhaps. I hope so. That would be nice. Yes. If we go play teams in Japan, yeah. we would beat that. Oh, we would kill them. Yeah. Philippines, can, Japan, Korea. Mm. That's the one that, uh, was that the one that Lance played in? Yes, Lance oh, yeah. played. They, they uh, won championship, right? Yeah, they mm. won Now you beat the but they didn't, But they didn't win CBA championship. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing to see. After playing 16 games with no fans, having fans in the game. It's really quiet. It's, yeah. But, it's, but we kind of used to it, though, because we practice every day with no fans. It was just us. But I think the game actually has some fun, so you're sure. Yeah, but that's, you that's for fans, though. The environment is different. That's for fans, though. See, athletes have this, this superhero ability. Yes. One thing about athletes, we have, uh, we have a great ability to zone in. So when we're at the games, like sometimes when I'm at the games, like I don't really notice a lot of the fans because I'm so focused on the game, you know, and I think that's a really good skill that athletes have, the ability to focus, you know what I mean, so. It's more excited about the fans can Yeah, definitely is, it's exciting, definitely exciting, but if they can, if they wouldn't lose sleep with the fans didn't come, you know. It's, uh, it's amazing to have them there, you know, but I would play basketball anywhere. Fans, no fans, I play in the middle of the sea, yeah. I play on the top of your house, <laughs> I play in here. What's that? Yes, stomach. No, yeah. no stomach. No stomach. I'm not eating stomach. Nothing. No, no, no organs. Yeah, no okay. Organs. No organs. No organs. But, but most cats love. I ate uh, chicken heart. Oh. Yeah, for the first barbecue. time in Hong Kong, I made a chicken heart. For barbecue or the. Right. Was it for barbecue? No, no, no. Yeah, it was a barbecue. I ate chicken heart and chicken Achilles. I didn't even know chickens had Achilles. <laughs> I didn't know that. All of them. Yeah, yeah, all of them have stories. I have a tattoo on my chest. I uh, represent my uncle. Um, he died of cancer in uh, 2011, so I have a big chest piece. And that's why I wear this 13, because he was he was born June 13th. Wow. Yeah, so that's why I wear it. That's why I wear 13. Yeah, it's on my arm, right here. I was uh, 17. 17? Yeah, when I first got it, yeah. I was on my way to college, university when I got my first tattoo. And uh, I went home, my mom went crazy. She went crazy, but after that, I'm like, I'm in university, she can't say anything, so you know. I'm at my mom's house, so I just went tattoo crazy, everything. I haven't got one in like four or five years, because they hurt really bad. Yeah, it's really hurt. Yeah, 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 really bad. Mm. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Bubble tea is the best thing ever. Hey tea. Yes, hi tea. Hey tea is the best. What cheese? Strawberry extra cheese. Strawberry extra, extra cheese. Chichi Are you ready for a long ride? 
Got my son Carl from Asian Super League accounts.